Hello everyone. Today I just want to quick uh, demonstrate to you um, the power of the Internet of Things. It's a very simple demonstration that uh, gets one of these devices. This is a Texas Instrument Sensor Tag connected to the cloud via SAP HANA Cloud Platform. And uh, I'll show you uh, this device actually passing data through my mobile phone, which I'm using now to record this video. Uh, my mobile phone works as a bridge, basically, for the sensor. So my, this is my sensor deployed, mobile phone is my gateway, and they are all connected to the HANA cloud platform where I have my dashboard demonstrating uh, real-time uh, as the data gets captured by this device. So this device is a very powerful little device, about 15 different sensors. It, it has a gyroscope, a magnetometer, a luxometer, accelerometer, um, IR temperature, uh, barometer, humidity detection, so it's pretty powerful and um, and it can, it can, as I say, as I said before, it can pass data through my mobile phone into, into the cloud. So I deployed a quick, uh, simple application, a job application, which I actually downloaded from SAP developer network and just redeployed to my HANA Cloud Platform environment which then has this uh, cockpit that uh, uh, gets the data from my device in real time. So the idea is just to demonstrate to you uh, how powerful and simple an Internet of Things deployment can be. And uh, for you to imagine and think beyond the simple device, but imagine like a billions or millions of devices connected and passing all kinds of different uh, measurements. So here we go. This is my dashboard. Um, on the HANA Cloud Platform and as I mentioned I've got my little device my Texas Instrument Sensor type here connect to the cloud and now I'm gonna turn it on and uh, get it moving so you notice that my yes as I move it closer to the screen you notice that my gauge start dancing a bit because I am moving it around so you see movement detector all the axes now at Thanks in my Y, my X, my Z, and humidity, you don't see much change because the humidity is all the environment, but pay attention to the luxometer. As I move closer to the screen, more light uh, gets now as I flip the around, more light gets detected by the sensor, right? So it goes higher, and now as I flip it back again, so you see the sensor sits on this side here, Therefore, less light, of course, less measurement. And now I move it again. You see it, my luxometer moves again, back to screen, straight away. So this is real time, as you can see, I'm connected to the cloud. So this is a HTTPS environment. Uh, it's real time getting the data. And as I move it, you see here, and you can see the temperature changing a little bit there because of uh, it's getting a little bit hotter. As I close my hand, it's warmer as well, so the device automatically detects it, right? Got very hot, now it's back to green, as you can see here, okay? So humidity didn't change much, as the environment kept uh, steady. Movement all the time dancing as I flip it around, luxometer again because of the light, move back, and so on. So this is just a simple demonstration to show you the power of those little things connect to the cloud and how much data, how much, uh, how many different use cases actually we can generate out of a simple application like that. I hope you enjoyed. See you next time.